so much to learn about. It'll make you want to shout, Blippi! And today we're at Odyssey in Scottsdale, Arizona. Come on. This is gonna be awesome. I think today you and I should learn about some animals. Whoa, look at this place. Oh, those are kind of like raindrops. Hello. Okay, let's go over here. Whoa, we're almost to the top! Whoa! Yeah, let's go! This is gonna be so much fun! Oh, did you see that? I just used two fingers on the back of the head in the back of this Russian sturgeon. Oh, it looks like he liked it. Whoa, it feels so cool. It's hard, but it also has kind of a layer of a slippery sludge on it. <laughs> it helps keep all the parasites away. Oh, here's another one. That is awesome! <laughs> Whoa, did you see that? I just touched the stingray nice and gently with my two fingers on its back. Whoa, okay, let's, uh, let's touch another one. Oh, here's one right over here. Oh, oh hey! Whoa, <laughs> that's silly. Ooh, come over here. Whoa. There's so many of them. Whoa. Look at that one. It's just resting on the ground. That's a different kind. Huh. Oh, here comes one. Whoa. Hey, I'll describe what it feels like. It kind of feels... Oh, here's one more. Whoa! Yeah, I really know what it feels like now. It feels like a wet gummy bear. <laughs> oh, so slippery and soft at the same time, but firm as well. Wow, <laughs> this is fun. Blippi, what are you doing? Oh, just sitting here looking at my favorite fish, the paddlefish. Ooh, paddlefish? That's pretty cool. It is. Well, see you later. Hope oh, see you later, Blippi. Whoa, this is pretty cool being behind the scenes of the aquarium. Hello. <laughs> this is awesome. Whoa. Oh, hey. So many cool workers here. Whoa, look at this. We're on top of an aquarium! Whoa, look at all that water and those fish down there! Whoa, okay, follow me. Whoa, look at this room! Whoa, there's so much scuba gear in here, tanks, wetsuits. Whoa, okay, we need to take this fish to the sharks. I bet they're really hungry. Come on! Whoa! Wow. <laughs> okay. Whoa, look at this. Whoever drew that is a good artist. It shows the different parts of a shark. Yeah, like the gills. Whoa. <laughs> Whoa, look. All right, we did it. Here you go. Hi, thank you. Yeah. You're welcome. What's your name? My name's Danny. Ooh, this is Danny, and what are you doing here? So we're here at She's actually feeding our big sharks right now. Whoa, look, I see a fish down there, look. Whoa, so what? why is she holding a fish on a pole? So that's how we get the food down to our sharks. If they're already low in the water column, she needs to be able to have a really long tool to get the food down to their mouth. Okay, so 
So they hold the pole, which has a fish on the end, and then the sharks come up and have some supper. <laughs> Ooh, and this looks like fun. Whoa. Those fish look big. How big is that fish that she's feeding the sharks? It's about this big. It's called a blue fish because that has a kind of blue tint to it. Okay. That's a blue fish. That's about this big. So, what kind of fish did I bring up? So, you brought up some herring, which is the big fish in here. Okay. And then some caitlin, which is the little fish in here. Okay. Huh. Interesting. Oh. Hey, well, this is pretty cool seeing someone else do it, but hey, can I feed some sharks? Yeah, absolutely. Okay. okay. Just make sure you have your gloves on so this can be kind of stinky. <laughs> okay, all right. Let's put the gloves on so then my hands don't smell like fish for weeks. <laughs> okay, all right, I got my gloves on. Uh, oh, there we go. One glove, two gloves. All right, so now what do I do? So, Bucket that you brought up from our kitchen, and we'll head over here. Okay. All right. Okay. All right. We'll head over to our feeding platform. Okay. As soon as you walk up, the fish will be all ready for us. Okay. Whoa! Look! I'm on the platform. Whoa! Look! There's no barriers between me and the fish. Okay. I'm just gonna jump in. Just kidding. All right, here we go. Can I throw one at a time? Yeah, whatever you want. Either one at a time or all of it at once. All right, enjoy this. Whoa, look at them go. They're really enjoying this food. Whoa, look at all of them. They're swarming to the top because they know that I'm throwing all this yummy food to them. All right, whee! Whee! Whoa! Here you go, bitch. Is that tasty? <laughs> is that tasty, fish? Or is that tasty? <laughs> okay, just a little left. Here we go. Whoa! That was so much fun! <laughs> Good job! Whoa! Ooh, she's feeding a turtle! Come on! Whoa! So many cool things up here! Whoa! Okay, let's go over here! Whoa! <laughs> Whoa! Okay, what are you doing? I am feeding Greta, our green sea turtle. Ooh, she's feeding Greta? That's a nice name. And this is Greta. Do you see Greta? Hey, Greta. Hey. Ooh, what does Greta like to eat? Greta loves lettuce, but she also enjoys cucumbers, bell peppers, and even sometimes carrots. Ooh, lettuce, bell peppers, Cucumbers and carrots? Sounds like Greta's really healthy. <laughs> Can I try feeding Greta? Yeah. Hey. Okay. Alright. How do I do it? Just a little bit? Yeah, just a little bit, but hold me if you just pop it in front of her. There you go, Greta. Whoa. Hey, what are you doing? It's trying to. Should I throw another one? Oh, sure. Go. There we go. Sometimes you just have some Okay. Alright. Ooh, Greta's hungry. Here you go, Greta. Yum. Here you go. Oh, Greta is really big. Do you know how much Greta weighs? She is a little bit over a hundred pounds. Oh wow, a hundred pounds. Wow. Oh, here you go. <laughs> okay, let's do a big piece. Let's watch Greta eat a whole piece. Here you go. Oh, it's right there. Yeah. Whoa. Hey. Uh oh. Whoa. That's a big piece of lettuce. Hello. Hey. Hello. Come on. 
since we just touched some animals, I think we should use this restroom and wash our hands. Let's go! Okay, welcome to the bathroom. Whoa, look! Whoa! Look! This restroom is underwater. And this restroom actually won the best restroom in America. Whoa, you can wash your hands right here? And look at shark! Sharks and fish! Whoa, this is awesome! <laughs> Pretty cool. All right, I wash my hands. Now I'll go dry them. You enjoy the view. Okay, let's go down the escalator to the deep ocean. <laughs> Come on. Like we're underwater. Look this way. <laughs> oh, that's awesome. I present to you the deep ocean exhibit. Hello! Hey! So this is a sea lion. Whoa. There's another one over here. Oh, it's so big! <laughs> so cool! Oh, look, look, look! Whoa, hello! <laughs> Whoa! And there's actually a seal in here as well. Let's go try and find it. Let's see. Oh, here it is. Hello. See that right here? This is a seal. Hi. So there's three sea lions in here and one seal. And the easiest way to tell the difference is this. I'll show you. So if you're a sea lion, you use your front flippers. So basically walk like this. <laughs> but seals don't do that. Seals. Oh, hello. Oh, you're curious, huh? <laughs> so curious. Whoa. So that's a sea lion. So it walks with its flippers. Hello, 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 hello. They're actually really smart animals. See how it's following me? I'll try and change directions. Whoa! <laughs> okay, and seals, they don't walk like that. You know, this is a sea lion. Sea lion. And a seal, they don't have that much power right here, and it's kind of short and stubby. So this is what they do. Just kind of waddle. Oh, oh, oh. That's silly. Wow, what magnificent creatures. Check them out a little bit more. Whoa, penguins? Yeah, we're behind the scenes at the aquarium and we're gonna meet some penguins. Come on. Okay, let's walk nice and slow, and we'll be very quiet as well. Ooh. Hey, who are you? Hutch. Ooh, this is Hutch. Hey, what do you do here? I work with the penguins and reptiles. Ooh, the penguins and the reptiles. Oh, do you see the penguins back there? Oh, 
Are these your only two penguins here? Oh no, we have more friends that are coming. Would you like to grab a toy? We're actually going to play with them. Sure. Okay, let's grab a toy and let's see some more penguins. Look over there. They also can see colors really well and have rods and cones in their eyes just like we do. Okay. They're kind of, although they're birds, they're kind of acting like kitty cats, huh? Just a little bit. They do like to play with a lot of different types of toys. And just like kitty cats, they tell us when they want to be touched. Okay. Huh. Interesting. It's pretty cool. Hey, get a closer look. Oh, bye-bye. <laughs> Penguins are so silly. So where are these penguins from? These penguins are from South Africa. Okay. And we have 32 of them here at the aquarium. Wow, 32 penguins here. And these are from South Africa? Yes. Not Antarctica? Not Antarctica. They're actually one of several species of penguins that prefer the warm climate. Oh, okay. That's pretty cool. Interesting. Warm climate and penguins. I guess you learn something every day. <laughs> okay, let's take a seat right over here. And then Hutch is gonna bring a penguin over. <laughs> I'm so excited. I get to touch a penguin. Ooh, hello. <laughs> okay, so I'm gonna touch the penguin with two fingers gently on its back. So soft. Did you know penguins have 70 feathers per square inch? Yeah, they're really small and really dense. Can I touch the gam punch? Yes, you can. Yeah. Does that feel good? You like that? She's showing off for you. What does that mean when she shakes her head? So that means she's really happy, uh, and you might be her new boyfriend. Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> I hope she doesn't want to kiss. <laughs> oh, hello! This is a little blue penguin. Mm -hmm. It's pretty small. Whoa! And this board has the sizes of different penguins. Oh, like the penguin I met today, an African penguin. Whoa, and they just keep getting bigger. Whoa, whoa, look how big they're getting. Whoa, look at how big this penguin is. Whoa, four feet tall, 1.3 meters high? Jeez, look how big it is. Oh, whoa, that's a really big penguin. Do you see its beak? <laughs> kind of looks like the shape of a banana. A really colorful banana. <laughs> There's another bird over here. Come on. Whoa. Hello. <laughs> a colorful parrot. Hey. How are you? <laughs> Whoa. Looks like it's yellow, blue, and on its head is green. <laughs> hey! Hey, there's another animal right over here I want to show you. Come on! Whoa, look! Look at this animal! It's moving really slow. <laughs> Do you know what animal this is? Yeah, this is a sloth. Let's act like a sloth together.
Hello. Hello. How are you? Ah. 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 <laughs> That's funny. All right. Hello. These are otters, and they're so cute. Look at them go underwater. Whoa. I bet they can hold their breath for a really long time. Whoa. They're so fast. Whoa. <laughs> they kind of look like water cats, <laughs> but they're not kitty cats. <laughs> Whoa. Hi. <laughs> Hello. <gasps> oh, another one. Whoa! <laughs> cool! Whoa! That was so much fun learning about all these creatures at Odyssey in Scottsdale, Arizona with you. Well, this is the end of this video, but if you want to watch more of my videos, all you have to do is search for my name. Will you spell my name with me? Ready? B-L-I-P-P-I. -P -P -I. Blippi, good job. All right, see you soon. <laughs> we are at Point Defiance Zoo and Aquarium in Tacoma, Washington. And today, we are gonna see some awesome animals. Let's go. Got my member's card. Okay, come on. This is gonna be so much fun. Okay, here we go. Hey, this is Cindy. And what do we have here, Cindy? That is a Pacific herring. Ooh, and we are about to go feed some penguins. Did you see how we walked up really low? You gotta stay low so then they don't get scared. are the color white. That polar bear, yeah, his name is Boris. And he's 31 years old. Boris was rescued from a circus, a traveling circus in Mexico. And it's really important to have ice so polar bears can hunt off of and get get seals in the Arctic. So we should be really aware of what we do to our planet so polar bears can have a lot of ice. Whoa! Boris is so pretty. See what 
that is? Yeah, that's a tiger. Meow. That's a really big kitty cat. <laughs> that's actually a Sumatran tiger to be exact. And there's only about 300 left on this entire planet in the wild. So here at Point Defiance Zoo and Aquarium, this tiger is an ambassador. <laughs> so this is Sarah. Hi. And Sarah, what do we have here? This is Gonzo, and he is a tree climbing anteater. And here at Point of Lions Zoo and Aquarium, we're training him to be part of our Wild Wonders Outdoor Theater show that's Ooh. brand new this summer. Hey, Gonzo. So, what are we gonna, have, yeah, what are we gonna be doing right now? You're gonna help me train Gonzo to eat vanilla yogurt Ooh. from a tube. Okay, so, so. This is something that he will love to do. Hold okay. that up Hold right it. up to his little nose. Okay, here and I he's go. He's gonna slurp that vanilla yogurt Ooh. right out with his super long tongue. Whoa. Check that out. Look at Gonzo's tongue, it's so long. Now, of course, in the wild, Gonzo would not eat vanilla yogurt. He would eat ants. And he has really big claws that he can use to break open ants' nests and termite mounds. And then he'd use his long tongue to slurp those bugs right up. Ooh, yum, that looks pretty tasty. Yeah. So Gonzo has been around people his whole entire life, and when he first came here, we started training him to be part of the show. So that's why he's so comfortable hanging out with us out here. Yeah, he seems like a really great and fun anteater. <laughs> What are you doing? I'm making some diets for the meerkats. Meerkats? I love meerkats. What else are you going to do today? Well, you know what? I was going to do some enrichment. Do you want to help me? Yeah. Excellent. Let's so, go over to the exhibit. OK. And what's enrichment? Enrichment is giving our animals choices, things to do, things to play with, kind of like kids on a playground. Ooh, that sounds fun. I like playing. So let's give them some choices. Okay. Let's put these wiffle balls okay. in the blue pool on exhibit. OK. All right. Wiffle balls, blue pool. Got it. this place. This is the exhibit from the habitat of where meerkats play. Whoa. <laughs> okay, anywho, back to it. Wiffle balls, blue pool. Right. Okay, let's put these in here. <laughs> this is going to be so much fun to see the meerkats play with these wiffle balls that we're putting in here. Okay, and the second one. Okay, here we go. Let's see what else she wants us to do. Hey, okay, here you go. Thank you. What else do you have well, for I've us? Well, I've got some more fun toys. Let's put these out on the exhibit as okay. well. Okay, where should I put these? Wherever you want. Ooh, this is gonna be fun. Where should we put these? Here, come on. Okay, let's see. Oh, let's see. I think the yellow one should go. Oh, do you see this? Let's put it right there. <laughs> And then, ooh, come back here. Let's put the pink one right, let's do this one right here actually, right next to the yellow one. And the really big red one, let's put over here. Here, I'll meet you over that way. Oh, it's like I'm a meerkat, watch. Okay, let's see what else we need to do. Come on. Okay, is that all? No, Blippi, let's okay. take the fun up a notch. Let's add some food enrichment to the toy enrichment. Ooh. Here's some mealworms. It's like chocolate for meerkats. Ooh, yum. Look at this. Ooh, yum. So where would you like me to put this? You know what? Let's sprinkle some in the wiffle balls. Okay. And if you want to put some elsewhere in the exhibit, you can do that too. Okay. It's kind of like a search and find because <laughs> we'll put some right here and then we'll hide some for them to find it okay so spread out the wiffle balls and let's sprinkle some 
on top of the wiffle ball. Wee! <laughs> Ooh, this is gonna be fun. Okay. Okay. Okay, there's a little bit more. Let's put some right on this ledge. Mmm, those look tasty. Okay, let's just put the rest in here. All right. I think we're ready. Are we all done? Great job, Blippi. Let's let him out. Okay. is a dromedary camel, and his name is Winchester. <laughs> dromedary camels are found in Africa, and if you're three years old and 36 inches or taller, you can ride camels at Point Defiance Zoo. They're really soft. Wow. We are in the Marine Discovery Center. In this place, has amazing sea creatures, and we can actually touch them. See? You can touch, but with only one finger, okay? Oh, look at these right here. Oh, that was scary. <laughs> that scared me. Oh, and look, here's a snail. Hello, hi, little guy. And hey, little girl. Hello. Whoa. Oh, oh, look at this over here. One finger. Woo! Did you see it? it? Like attached to my finger. Here, get a really good close. Oh, look at how big this one is. Okay, ready? Woo! Wee! Oh, it attaches to your finger and it's so soft. Oh, last but not least, starfish. Whoa! Whoa! They're really hard. So cool. And these are actually alive. They're real sea creatures. <laughs> they don't move very much, but they do move. Really slow. I really love the Marine Discovery Lab. <laughs> Carousel, come on! Hey, horsey! This is gonna be so much fun! See? It's a carousel! And right here, this is the instrument panel that turns on the carousel. And I got the key! <laughs> okay, let's put in the key right there. <laughs> and... Some more horses. Oh, a polar bear. We saw one of those today. A zebra. Did you see the zebra? Oh, a pig. Ooh, ooh. <laughs> ooh tiger. Ooh, an anteater. Okay. Now I think it's time for us to ride the carousel. Come on. But first, we need to pick our favorite animal. We gotta wait for it to stop. Come this way. Wait, the zebra? Hmm, I don't know if I wanna ride the zebra. Let's see what else. A horse, a polar bear. So much fun. Okay, this animal, yeah, is a poison dart frog. And I am going to ride this animal. Gotta buckle up first. And once I'm all buckled up, oh, gotta loosen that up a little bit. 
Oh. All right. I am ready to ride. Here we go. See, we spin around and around as well as go up and down. Whoa! Hey, horsey! Whoa! Look! This poison dart frog is the color yellow. Today, we are at the Florida Aquarium, and this is gonna be so much fun! Let's go! Whoa! This area, you can actually touch stingrays with two fingers, okay? Come on. I didn't quite get him. Oh, here he is. I touched him. And he's really soft. And it kind of has a little mucus type of feel. Really slippery. Oh, look at that one. Hey. Look. <laughs> it's a sea turtle. Hi. Oh. Teko, you want to dance? Whoa! Look! Hey! Whoa, look at all the fish! And did you see that stingray? Wow! There's so many tropical fish in here! Whoa, like that little guy! Okay, let's go down here. Whoa, there's hundreds of them. Look at the angelfish. Hey. Ooh, this is a black and yellow fish. Hello. Wow. Keep, keep going. They kind of look like rocks. See those? But they're actually alive. Okay. Oh, what do you do right here? Ooh, I think it's time for a picture. Did you see its tail? They have really long tails. Ooh, let's go on this side. Ooh, there's a big shark. I have a better place to see all these fish at. Hurry, let's go quick. Shark. 
is a really big aquarium. Ooh, it's coming close. Look at that one. After seeing all different types of sea creatures under the aquarium, I got to go on top of the aquarium and do something really special. Whoa! Look at this place! We are on top of the coral reef at the Florida Aquarium. This is a little behind the scenes for you. I've never been on top of an aquarium before. Oh, look at who it is. What's your name? Oh, hi, I'm Eric, and you're Blippi. Yeah, wow. I'm Blippi. Can't so, believe you're visiting. Yeah, what do you do here? Oh, I'm a curator here at the Florida Aquarium. Okay. We're right on top of the coral reef, and curators take care of animals, and we can care, and it means everything from round the clock health care to, guess what? what? Feeding time. Ooh, yeah. I love food. I love food too. It's lunchtime. <laughs> yeah. Oh, it is? It is. It's lunch for the sharks, it's lunch for our big turtle flip you're going to meet for all of the thousands of fish that are in our environment here called the Florida Coral Reef. Woohoo! All right, I think it's time. Let's go. Flippy, we're heading over to the feed station right now, and let me introduce you to Alyssa. Hello. Hi. How are you? Good, how about you? Good. So we are about to be feeding the deep side of our reef tank. Okay. We got a lot of different fish here, but we have a lot of different fish in the reef that like to eat. So right there. Take a good sniff. That's some fresh Ooh. fish there. Yeah. Yum. Yeah. <laughs> Nice big mackerel. Ew. So what we'll have you do is put on some gloves. Oh, I should have done that first. <laughs> it's super simple. Take a big scoop of fish. Okay. And you're just gonna throw it out into the reef. And you'll oh. see a bunch of fish swim up. All in four. Yeah. All right. Well, so can I try now? Yeah, absolutely. Okay. okay. I think all one is all I need. Big scoop. Yeah. Uh, what's in here exactly? Boy. So right there we have some squid. Uh -huh. We have some herring, we have clam, and night smelt. It's oh, a whole mix. Can I sneak a little for myself? Yeah, yeah lunch is not going to come fast. <laughs> All right, where to? Over this way, yep. right field. That's a sports turn. Yeah. Good job. That looks tasty. All that right. looks like some good squid and mackerel there. Yeah. Three, two, one. Hey, Blippi, you're doing a great job. Now let's go down below and see what it looks like to be a fish underwater watching all that food come down. Okay, Ready? let's go. Let's go. Alyssa, take us from here. After feeding all of the sea creatures from above the aquarium, Eric took me back down below so we could watch all of the sea creatures eat all of the food I just fed them. It was so spectacular. And then I went on over to the wetlands exhibit. Whoa! Look! A duck! It's so cute! Do you see it? Quack, 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 Can you make the sound of a duck? Quack, quack, quack! This area is where they have the otters. Look! Whoa! Look at him do backflips! This place is so beautiful! Whoa! Whoa! A python! A python. Whoa, look how big it is! Jeez, that's scary. Come on! Ooh, some cute birds over here! These are spoonbills. And they're white and pink! Look, he's looking for food! Whoa! 
There's some big fish over here. Whoa. Those fish are so big. Whoa. Get really close. Can you see it? Such a big fish. And here's some more fish. Go up really close to the glass. <laughs> Let's see what else they have here. I had such a great time at the Florida Aquarium. Next time you're in Tampa, Florida, you can go check out some sea life. Whoa! Hey, it's me, Blippi! Whoa! And look at where we're at! Yeah, today we're at Aquarium of Boise in Boise, Idaho! And this place is awesome. Yeah, it's an aquarium! Have you ever been to an aquarium before? Yeah, it's so cool because they have so many marine animals here. Yeah, marine animals are animals that live in the water. Well, shall we go explore? Let's go. Whoa. Oh, there's so many different kinds of fish in here. Whoa, they're all back there. Oh, hello. <laughs> Whoa, look up here. Looks like a list of different types of fish. Oh, look at that one. That one's called a yellow tang. Yeah, and it's all yellow. <laughs> I wonder why it's called yellow tang. <laughs> Ooh, and look at this one. It says purple tang. Ooh, looks like it's purple and yellow. Whoa, Ooh, and that one way over there. Whoa, powder blue tang. Wow. Yeah, it's blue and yellow. Okay, let's try and find them. Um, let's find the yellow tang. <laughs> yeah, they're pretty distinct looking, huh? All yellow. Okay, not that one. <gasps> Wait, there's one way over there. Do you see it? It's so far back there. Oh, it's hiding. Hello, yellow tang. <laughs> Look up there. Yeah, an orange, white, and black fish. <gasps> I know what that is. Look up here. Yeah. That's the fish. It's a clownfish. Look up there. Do you see that blue fish? Yeah, it's just pure blue. It's really bright and vibrant. And look up here. Whoa, it's a blue damselfish. It's so bright and blue and colorful. Cool. See you later, fish. <laughs> Whoa, more fish. <laughs> Whoa. Look at this in here. Wait a second. This looks like the same shape as the last clownfish, but this one is just black and white. Yeah, do you see it right there? Yeah, a black and white striped fish. Here comes another one. Wait, yeah, this is actually a type of clownfish. Yeah, but can you think of an animal that lives on land that's black and white stripes? Yeah, a zebra. Wow, cool. These are the zebras of the ocean. <laughs> see you later, clownfish. Whoa, did you see that? Yeah, that looked like a puffer fish to me. Whoa, actually, it's a porcupine puffer. Yeah, looks really smooth right now. But if it gets frightened or scared or angry, what it does is its cheeks puff out and its whole body, yeah, becomes spiky. Yeah, it's a defense mechanism. Super cool. <laughs> Whoa, and look down here. Whoa, do you see this? Wow, looks like an eel. Yeah, this is actually a yellowhead moray eel. And it's just hanging out in the rocks. Yeah, just chilling. Yeah, that's what eels like to do. Hang out in the rocks and just poke their heads out. <laughs> All right, see you later. Fun hanging out with you. <laughs> oh, what else do they have here? <laughs> Whoa, look at this. Looks like an old boat that then 
water got into and rocks over the years. Whoa, it's a perfect fish habitat. Oh, and look at what I have. <laughs> yeah, some snacks for the fish. Yeah, just like how you and I like snacks. Yeah, fish like snacks too. Oh, and they said I can actually feed these fish. All right, first let's try these peas. There we go. <laughs> All right, pour it in my hand. And then we'll see if the fish like to come and eat some food. Here you go. Whoa, do you see all those fish? Yeah, those are Japanese koi fish. There's so many of them and they're so colorful. All right, we have a little bit more food over here. All right, hello, Japanese koi fish. Yeah, all right, here you go. Whoa, are you hungry? Oh, they're so cool looking. They're so colorful. Yeah, some are orange and black, some are white and black, and some are white, black, and orange. Oh, see you later. <laughs> All right, what else is around here? Whoa, look at this tank. This tank is massive. Looks like the fish are all on the other side. Oh, but there's a lot of gallons and liters of water in here. Oh, oh, and look at this. Whoa, looks like a scuba diver. Whoa, do you see this helmet? It looks like a port right here. Yeah, scuba divers have this area so then they can see while they're underwater. Oh, and scuba divers wear this outfit so then they can stay warm under the water and so they can breathe underwater. You know how you and I have to hold our breath underwater? Scuba divers can breathe while they're underwater. Cool. Oh, and do you see this big weight? Yeah, us humans, we tend to float. So this weight is holding the scuba diver on the bottom of the sea floor. So then this scuba diver can work. Yeah, looks like the scuba diver works underwater. Wow! Whoa, look at all these tanks! Wow, this is so cool! Ooh, and look at this one! It's really big and bright and vibrant. Yeah! Do you see that? Yeah, that orange thing? That is actually a sea anemone. Whoa, and do you see those rock looking things up there? Yeah, they're also pretty bright. Those are coral. Yeah, sea anemones and coral. Yeah, they're actually animals. They kind of just look like rocks, huh? Those coral do? <laughs> well, hey, do you see how bright they are and just vibrant in color? Yeah, it's actually because there's algae that lives inside the sea anemone. <laughs> Isn't that interesting? Whoa, oh look. You see how that fish is just hanging out with that sea anemone and right next to all that coral? Yeah. Coral is actually really, really important because a bunch of fish like these ones actually live in all the coral. Yeah, it's just like how you and I live in a house. Yeah, these fish love to live inside the coral. Oh, and around the coral and use sea anemones as a nice soft bed. <laughs> so cozy. Oh, oh, and look at this one. Oh, it's really bright and green. Whoa, so cool. Hey, remember how we saw that eel hanging out in the rock and the coral? Yeah, they're just hanging out in their homes. <laughs> See you later, enjoy your homes. <laughs> Look over here. Wow, this is a big tank. Whoa, do you see that fish way over there? Whoa, yeah, there's a fish way back there. It's so big. It's a bumblebee grouper. Yeah, and actually they live to be 80 to 100 years old. But this one's only about 10 years old. So it's gonna get way bigger. Whoa, whoa, these are some big fish in here. Whoa, look at these. Hello, hey, and look at the bottom. Whoa, do you see all those? Yeah, they definitely look like sharks, huh? <laughs> Look at them just hanging out out the bottom. Whoa. Whoa. Look at these fish. More big fish. Yeah, these are Paku. Yeah, Pakus to be exact, because there's many of them. Whoa, and they kind of look like really big piranhas. Yeah, and actually they eat 
vegetables. They're herbivores. Yeah. You see how big they are? Oh. And actually, let me show you something right up here. It's really cool. Yeah, here's the teeth. Do you see this? Yeah, they kind of look like human teeth that they have, huh? Oh. And I have a big treat for us. Yeah. These pakus, I bet, are very hungry, and we have a nice yummy snack for them. Yeah, these are almonds. Watch out, they might splash. Whoa! Look at them go! <laughs> Whoa! Whoa! I'm throwing them down so then they hear and see them splash. There we go. Yeah, it's like they're falling off of trees. Whoa, here you go. Whoa, they must be really hungry. Let me do a few at the same time. Whoa, whoa, don't worry everyone. There's more for everyone. Here you go. Whoa, cool. <laughs> whoa, all right, here's some more. <laughs> Wow, aren't they cool? They must be very, very hungry. Whoa, cool. <laughs> wow, wasn't this so much fun learning about marine animals together? Yeah, I had a great time learning with you. <laughs> well, this is the end of this video though. But if you wanna watch more of my videos, all you have to do is search for my name. Will you spell my name with me? <laughs> B-L-I. P-P-I, Lippy. Good job. All right, see you again. <laughs>
is Look, it? way over here. Come on. Do you see what it is? Oh. Oh my goodness. A really cute sea otter. Yeah. Hey. <laughs> wow. Sea otters are so cool. Whoa. Wow. They're in the water. Hey. They can swim in the water and be on land. Yeah. And their fur is really, really dense. Yeah. Oh, look, they're snuggly. Oh, they're so cute. Hey. I wonder if they're best friends. Like us. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Their hair is so dense. Actually, it's fur. Yeah. yeah. There's about a million pieces of hair in about that big of size. That's super duper furry. Yeah. <laughs> That's equal to about all the hair on an average sized dog. Wow, that's a lot of fur. Yeah, whoa. They like to dive down and find their food, things like shellfish, crab. Clams, yeah. sea urchins. Yep, and they'll bring it up out of the water onto a rock and hang out and eat their food. Yum, yum, yum. <laughs> <laughs> and did you see how their front hands kind of look like hands, but their back feet yeah, they're actually kind of flippers. Yeah. <laughs> so then they swim with their back flipper feet. Yup, <laughs> it's like flippers in the back and paws in the front. Yeah, check them out. Wow. Well, there it goes. Wow, <gasps> check it out. They're so tiny. Yeah, teeny tiny jellyfish. Yeah. Wow, look at them go. They're just swimming like this. Whoop. before. I know, they're so small. <laughs> oh, and look over here, Mika. Whoa. Oh, these are a little bit bigger. Yeah, we can call these medium-sized <laughs> jellyfish. That's right. Wow, oh, look at their long tentacles. Whoa. Oh, hello. Hi. How's your day going? <laughs> Whoa, Mika, look. Wow. Big jellyfish. Yeah. Wow! Look at that! Yeah! Jellyfish are so cool. They don't have hearts, they don't have brains, but they need to eat food to survive. Yeah! They're living creatures. That's right! Wow! That is so cool. And if you ever see a jellyfish, you want to make sure not to touch it because they sting. Yeah! Wow! Oh, hello. <laughs> and do you see the brown tentacles? Looks like hair. Yeah, that hair tentacle looking type of things, that's what actually stings you if you touch it. Good thing this is glass. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> well, I'll see you later, jellyfish. Wow, pretty. <laughs> so we saw small jellyfish, mm -hmm. medium-sized jellyfish. And big jellyfish. Yeah. <laughs> oh, look over here. Oh, come on. Whoa. Hello! I'm Blippi! I'm Mika! <laughs> and this is a puffin! Wow! Oh. Hi, buddy! Look at him just floating on top of the water! Yeah! Oh, see you later! <laughs> Puffins are super cool because they can dive down into the water and catch a lot of fish! Yeah! Ten fish is pretty normal for them to catch in one dive! Yeah! yeah. And do you see those rocks up there? Yeah, that's where they live. Yep, see? All the way up top, they're just hanging out together on the rocks. <laughs> yeah, if there's a cliff next to water, you might find some puffins. Mm -hmm. <laughs> hey, puffin! Hey! Whoa, their beaks look so cool. Whoa, check it out! So colorful in there. Yeah, it's a coral reef. Yeah. <laughs> Do you see all those fish? They're so colorful. Yeah, there's a lot in there. Yeah, ooh, look at that one right there. It's just yellow. Yeah. So yellow, it looks like the sun. Yeah, it's so bright. <laughs> Woo. Oh, Flippy, I bet you'd like that one over there because it's orange, one of your favorite colors. Oh yeah, you're right. And there's white stripes on it and black. That one looks really cool. <laughs> yeah. Ooh, that one right there 
Yeah, it has a blue body and a yellow tail. Oh, cool. Whoa. Ooh. You see any other colorful ones, Mika? Hmm. Oh, I see a black and white one coming this way. Oh, yeah, black and white stripes. Yeah, almost like a zebra. <laughs> yeah, that is so cool. Ah. Ooh, and look at that one right there. Ooh. Wow. Yeah, a blue body <laughs> with some black and a yellow tail. Wow. wow. There are so many colors in here. Yeah, so colorful. <laughs> Look at this! These are some of the teeniest, tiniest frogs I have ever seen. These are poisonous dart frogs and can typically be found in the rainforest. Do you know what color that is? Yeah, it's like a red orange. Poisonous dart frogs come in so many different sorts of colors and their bright colors tell animals and people to stay away because they're really poisonous, but they're so cute. <laughs> Oh, I think there's some more over here. Come on. Wow. These have white stripes down their back. They look so cool. They're poisonous because of the poison in the food that they eat. <laughs> you have to stay away. But wow, they're just really adorable and fabulous. <laughs> Mika, look. <laughs> Check it out. More frogs. Whoa! These are magnificent tree frogs. Whoa! It's the color green. Yeah! That's called camouflage. It blends in with its environment. Yeah, do you know what is green in here? Yeah, leaves. Whoa! So then other animals can't see those frogs. So cool! <laughs> Ooh, look down here. These are Mexican salamanders. Yeah, also known as oxalotls. What a silly name. Whoa, hello. Yeah, they're typically darkish, greenish, brownish in the nature. Yeah, so then they blend in to their environment, just like those frogs. Yeah, <laughs> see you later. <laughs> Whoa, check it out. Yeah, it's an octopus. Can you see it? Yeah. Whoa. Octopuses have eight arms. Yeah. Whoa. <laughs> we, together, have four. One, two, three, four. Whoa. Times that by two, and then you have eight. Yeah, can you imagine <laughs> having eight arms? Whoa, that'd be so cool. Yeah, and octopuses have little suction cups on their arms so that they can taste wherever they go. Yeah, and it sticks to things. Whoa! Yeah. <laughs> and octopuses can actually change color and texture. That's called camouflage. Yeah, and they're also really, really smart. <laughs> yeah, and did you know octopuses, their mouths are actually beaks. <laughs> Changing it's colors. Oh, hello, octopus. Hi. Whoa, take a closer look. Yeah. <laughs> Whoa. Bunch of sharks! Yeah. Wow! But I actually heard that we can get in! What? Yeah! That's so cool! Shall we? Yeah! Okay! Whoa! You need to be very careful! Do not step on any of these sharks! Excuse us! Excuse us! Woo. Ooh, it's a little cold and chilly! Whoa! Wow! Yeah, these are shark jaws. Yeah. And look at all the teeth. There's so many teeth. Whoa, yeah. hello. For sharp. Yeah. Whoa. Are they sharp? Whoa, yeah, they are. Look at this really big one. 
Wow, Mika, cool! Wow. wow. And this shark jaw, yeah, the teeth are really small. This jaw is actually the same type of sharks in here. Yeah. So cute. Much smaller than something like this. Yeah. Ooh, and look at this. Bet you can't guess what shark this comes from, Mika. Uh, it's one tooth, and it comes from a shark that's really big. It's a really great shark. Oh, the great white shark, Flippy? Yeah! <laughs> Whoa, look how big that tooth Whoa. is! Oh, no! <laughs> ah, chomp, 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 chomp. <laughs> so silly. Wow! Yeah. So, Mika, we can actually touch these sharks. Whoa! Yeah! I wonder what they feel like. I know, I'm so excited. Oh, hello, shark. Hello, come here. Are you ready to get pet? Ooh, you think they're a little shy. Oh, here's oh. one. Here one comes. Come on over. Oh, yeah, I did. What did it feel like? It actually felt a little rough. Oh. Uh, the skin of these sharks feel like sandpaper. Oh, it's so rough. Oh, oh, here's one. Oh, oh, there he goes. <laughs> oh, here's one for you, Mika. Here you go. Whoa. Oh, it's rough. Not smooth at all. <laughs> nope. <laughs> hey, come check out over here. What's over here? Yeah. Whoa. Get out nice and safe. Hey. Then, Whoa. go right over here. <laughs> yeah. Check it out. Whoa. A Ray. bunch of rays. Yeah. yeah. Whoa, look at them. Whoa. Hey, Ray. <laughs> Shall we get in? Yes, I can't wait. Yeah. Here we go. Yay. Ooh, Jesus. Jesus. <laughs> wow. Whoa. 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 So in here you want to shuffle your feet. So then you don't step on any of the rays. Yeah, good idea. Ooh. Ooh. Push up, push up, push. Look right over there, Mika. Is this food for the rays? It is. Whoa. Special surprise. <laughs> Yeah. Ooh, and is there another one? Yep, this is oh, for you. Oh, thank you so much. And this is for me. All right. So how we feed them is we just toss it out. Look at this. Woo, <laughs> some fish in here. Yeah. Anybody hungry? Looks like some shrimp. Woo, check it out. Wow. Want some food? Looks pretty yummy if you were a ray, huh? Actually, we can touch them too. Really? What yeah. do they feel like? Oh, you tell me. Yeah. Wow. You want to do two fingers along their back. Okay. Nice and soft. Oh, there's one behind us. Oh, hey, Ray. Whoop. Oh, here's one. Hello. Hi. Oh. Whoa. Whoa. Oh, oh. It's like you gave me a high five. Cool. It actually kind of feels like. <laughs> I don't know yet. <laughs> oh, here you go. Time to eat. Whoa. Whoa. Yep, I felt that one. Yeah, different than the sharks that were really rough. Yeah, these are really smooth and I slippery. <laughs> Whoa. 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 <laughs> so silly. Whoa. Wow, now they really want to eat. Yeah, they kind of look like uh, diamonds. Yeah. yeah. And they flap their wings. Oh, he's trying to eat my foot. Oh. There you go. <laughs> wow, that was so much fun. Yeah, what a great night at the aquarium. Yeah, we saw so many cool animals. Yeah, like those adorable sea otters. <laughs> and those jellyfish. <laughs> and the octopus. Whoa, with eight arms. Wow, and those crabs. <laughs> wow, that was so much fun. Yeah, so many <laughs> underwater creatures. Yeah, well, this is the end of this video. But if you want to watch more of my videos, all you have to do is search for my name. Will you spell my name with me? <laughs> B-L-I-P-P-I. Flippy, -P -P -I. good job. Wait a second. 
Nika. How do you spell your name? Oh, I'll show ya. N E E A H. Nika. <laughs> so cool. See you later. See you soon. Bye bye. <laughs> Have a great night, Blippi and Mika. Thank you. you See ya. Ooh, 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 ooh. Hey, it's me, Blippi. And look at where I'm at. Today, I'm at Pet Zoo in Cochia, Brazil. Wow, this place is awesome because they have so many cute animals that you actually get a pet. Maybe that's why they call it Zoo. And today, you and I, we're gonna learn how to take care of animals. Are you ready? All right, let's go. <laughs> Did you see that? These two horses were scratching each other. Wait a second, they don't look like horses, do they? They do look like horses, but way smaller. Oh yeah, you're a pony, right? Yeah, these two ponies are actually sisters. Hey, you two are so cute. And they are so soft. Look at this one. This one is white. And this one is brown. Oh, do you two like me? Because I sure do like you. Oh, whoa, check it out. Whoa, carrots. Interesting. <laughs> do you like carrots? I do too. And I heard that these ponies love carrots. Shall we see if they're hungry? Oh, here you go. Whoa, are you hungry? Oh, whoa, they are hungry. Whoa, I guess ponies love carrots. Can you think of any other animal that loves carrots? Yeah, maybe one that likes to hop? Yeah, bunnies love carrots. Here you go. Here's some more. Oh, they are so nice to each other. I wonder if they like to play with each other. They definitely know how to scratch each other's backs. <laughs> here you go. Aww. <laughs> All right, here you go. Oh, and did you see this one? Yeah, look right here. Okay, let me turn it side right here. And do you see its hair? Yeah, its mane? Whoa, it's braided. Whoa, it's so cute. Oh, you don't have braided hair, but that's okay. Oh, you want food? Okay, here you go. <laughs> All right, well, let me set this right here and maybe I'll see you later. But if not, have a great day. Bye-bye. <laughs> Come on, let's go. Whoa, check it out. It's so pretty right here. Wait a second, are you thinking what I'm thinking? Yeah, photo shoot. <laughs> yeah, this place is awesome. Let's keep exploring. I think I see some more animals, come on. Hello! Whoa! This is a llama! Hey, are you hungry? Because I think I see some food. Come on, come over here. Check it out! Yeah, a big white bucket of llama food! Whoa! Here you come. Here, you can come right over here. Whoa! Llamas are so cool! Yeah, they actually. Whoa! <laughs> Okay, patience. <laughs> okay, here you go. Do you see their food? Yeah, they love this stuff. It's so tasty. I'll hold out my hand nice and flat. Whoa, can you see its teeth? Here you go. Whoa, they're so crooked. <laughs> That's okay. Here you go. Is anyone else hungry? Oh, it looks like you have some friends. They don't look as hungry as you. Here you go. Wow, do you see this llama's ears? Very big ears. I bet it can hear very well. Oh, and did you know llamas can spit, but llamas actually do it in defense. Yeah, it's a defense mechanism. Yeah, if they ever get scared or anything like that, 
They can spit. Whoa, you are so cool. Whoa, and you're so soft. Whoa, that was so much fun. All right, have a good day. Well, shall I keep exploring? Yeah, come on. Whoa, check it out. Now this is a giant bird. This is an ostrich. They're the biggest bird in the whole entire world. Whoa, hey. This, yeah, his name is Romeo. Wow, and he is so tall, even taller than me. And did you know ostriches' brains are so small, they're smaller than their eyes. Wow, they must not be very smart, right? Oh, but they can run so fast. And did you know ostriches can't fly? Oh, who would have known? <laughs> wow, we'll see if Romeo is hungry, shall we? Check it out. Whoa, looks like we have some greeny leaves right here. Whoa, and then some pellets. Here you go. All right, Romeo, here you go. You want some pellets? Huh, maybe, here he comes. Okay, what about some green leaves? Here you go. Okay, here you go, Romeo. No? I guess Romeo's not hungry. <laughs> wow, they take care of their pets so well here. Yeah, a great way to take care of animals is to keep them nice and fed. And since Romeo's not hungry, someone must have fed him earlier. <laughs> Whoa, look, that ostrich was Big. Now these birds are medium sized. Whoa, two of these are actually younger ostriches. And then two of these are emus. Yeah, yeah, it's a different type of bird. And they're medium sized. Oh, they look so soft. I wish I could pet them. Wow, is anyone hungry? No, no one's hungry again? Whoa, they're taken care of very well here. Whoa, all right, see you later. <laughs> Woo! Oh, that was cool! Whoa! Chickens! Wow! Here you go! Hey, chickens! Hey, chickens! Here you go! Are you hungry? Yeah! These chickens look like they're very hungry! Whoa! What about you? Anyone else? Here you go! Whoa, I actually got special permission to go inside with these chickens. Okay, here, I'll be inside real soon, okay? <laughs> here you go, birds. Wow, they are so cute. Who's hungry? Anyone hungry? Wow, chickens are so cool. Yeah, look at this one. This one is the color brown, and it sure does love this green leaf. Oh, hey, look at you, little cutie pie. Oh, this one's so small. And it's the color white. Here you go. Whoa, I love taking care of animals. <laughs> yeah, you make sure that they have a lot of water, a lot of food. Oh, whoa, and check that out. It looks like the chicken's home. This is called a chicken coop. I'm gonna go inside. <laughs> Whoa! Yeah, this is the chicken coop. Wow, they love to hang out in here. Oh, and look at this one. Just relaxing? Yeah, I wonder if this one's sitting on some eggs. Hey, it's me, Blippi. Oh, let me set these down right over here. Whoa, and we heard, yeah, that one of these is really nice. Maybe it will let me pick it up. There you go. Hey, cutie pie. Wow. Look at it. Whoa, this is a small chicken. You are so cute. Oh, do you see it has some red on its face? Yeah, and it's black and white. Okay, I'll set you down, okay? I hope you have a great day. <laughs> Whoa, here you go. Okay, see you later. Oh, let me pick these up and let's keep exploring. Let's see what else we can find here. <laughs> That was so much fun seeing that chicken coop. Yeah, whoa, check it out. This doesn't look like a chicken coop. 
This actually looks like where humans live. Yeah, this is called a Pawapiki. Yeah, this is a traditional Brazilian house. Whoa, I'm so curious to see what it's like. Let's go. <laughs> Whoa, it's so cool in here. Yeah, Pawapiki? Yeah, that means clay and wood. Yeah, do you see this? It's made with clay and sticks, tree branches. Whoa, even maybe stumps too. Then you combine it all and it makes the house nice and strong. It is very nice in here. Wow, Power Peaky House. Wow, what a cool name and what a cool house. Yeah, you can do so much in here without electricity. Power Peaky House Music Party. That was really fun. Well, I should probably put these back where I found them. Whoa! Hey, check it out. Yeah, this is the stove. How do you make heat if you don't have electricity? Fire. Yeah, you can build a fire, which then you can, say, boil water and make some nice tea and have a tea party. Yum! <laughs> oh, and look at this. Wow, what a cool device. This you can use to make cheese. Whoa, cheese please. Whoa, it is so cool how people can make so much with no electricity. Whoa, well, shall I keep exploring the pet zoo? <laughs> Let's go. This has been so much fun today. And do you see what that says? It says farmhouse. Yeah, let's see what lives inside this house. Whoa! Whoa, check it out. It looks like we have some animals. Hey! And actually, they left me some food to feed them. Whoa, this is gonna be nice. Speaking of nice, wow, what a great farmhouse. Hey, let me put this on. Oh, there we go. All right. Hey! Whoa, did you see that? Yeah, it looked like a goat. Oh, maybe I can bring them out here so then you can see. Here they come. Hey, goats. Hey, it's me, Blippi. Are you hungry? Oh, there you go. Yum. Whoa. I should probably go inside, right? Whoa. Okay. They gave me special permission to be able to come inside here. Okay. Hey, goats. Whoa. How are you? Whoa, they are so cool. Yeah, it looks like there's whoa, so many. Whoa. Hey, here's one right here. Hey, are you hungry? Whoa, how are you? Oh, you are so cute. Yeah, it's the color white. Oh, it has a little black on its head and brown. Whoa. And they said this one actually likes to get picked up. Yeah. <laughs> you are so cute. This is a baby goat and it is so soft. And look how big its ears are. I bet they can hear very well. Oh, okay. I'll set you down nice and gently. Here you go. All right. See you later. Whoa! That farmhouse was so cool. I love taking care of all these animals. <laughs> Whoa! Speaking of animals, whoa! Look at this. Yeah, hey, looks like a big cow, right? Whoa, <laughs> this is actually a bull. I know it's a bull because of its antlers. Wait a second, it doesn't have antlers, it has horns. Do you see that? The difference between antlers and horns are antlers fall off of the animal. But bulls, they have horns. These stay on the bull its whole life. Whoa, are you hungry? Whoa, he's so big. Here you go. You want some food? Whoa, Whoa I felt his tongue. Oh, you are so cool. And do you see his teeth? Here you go. Whoa, whoa, hey. Whoa, can I pet you? Oh, wow. His nose feels so nice. Whoa, what about your head? Oh, do you like pets? Yeah, some animals to take care of them. Yeah, you want to pet them and love them. 
Ooh, and you can even brush them. Yeah, some animals like pets, some animals don't like pets. But this bull loves pets, right? Whoa! Or are you just hungry? Another way to take care of animals. Yeah! Give the animal some food. Whoa! Whoa! It's so slobbery. Every time I put my hand, yeah, for food, yeah. He licks it with his tongue and pulls it in. And it gets my hand all slobbery. <laughs> all right, see you later. It was fun taking care of you today. You are so cute. <laughs> Do you like the pets? Oh, are you wagging your tail? Are you cute? Okay, see you later. <laughs> Look right here! Yeah! Remember earlier how I said you have to take care of the pens? Yeah! Looks like someone took care of these pens, made sure it's nice and clean. <laughs> Whoa! Hey! Another animal! Whoa! Ooh, this is a jumento. Here you go. Oh, are you hungry? Wow, doesn't it look like a donkey? Whoa, and the Jumentos. Yeah, their cheese made from their milk is some of the most expensive cheese in the whole wide world. Okay, see you later. Yeah, I heard there's some real donkeys right over here. Wow, Jumentos and donkeys? Yeah, they're related to each other. But these, yeah, they're donkeys. Hey, whoa, are you too hungry? Hey, do you see how big its ears are? Oh, here you go. Oh, do you want a nice snack? What about pets? Do you like the pet? Did you see how I didn't love to get pet? Yeah, that's okay. <laughs> I don't have to pet you. Or maybe he's just pulling away because he's actually hungry. Yeah, sometimes they might actually really like pets. But right now, maybe this one just wants a bunch of food. Yum, 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 yum. <laughs> Oh, yeah, and this one's the color brown. And this one is also the color brown. Hey, ooh, you have some white on your face. Ooh, and I actually heard, yeah, this donkey's name is Juka. Yeah, you know my good friend Juka? Whoa, you two have the same name. Ooh, Juka, you love pets, don't you? You do, you do, do you? <laughs> and you also love food. Here you go. Wow, and their pen looks nice and clean. Wow, you are taken care of very well. I love taking care of animals. <laughs> All right, see you later, Yuka. Bye-bye. <laughs> Whoa, check it out. Here at Pet Zoo, they even have a playground. Whoa, I do love playing. All right, first thing I should do is probably take off my shoes, right? Oh, <laughs> will you count my shoes with me? Ready? <laughs> Here's one, all right, and two. One, two, I have two shoes. Okay, let me put it right in here in those cubbies. And now it's time to play. Whoa, look at this. Looks like you climb inside. Whoa, 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 it's pretty wobbly. Whoa, whoa, look at how high I am up here. A big blue slide! I love slides! Okay, here I come! Whoa! Whoa! I got a little stuck! Not the fastest slide, but that's okay! It was still fun! Come on! Whoa, I should probably grab my shoes, but over here, there's another fun thing to do! Come on! A trampoline! Ooh, and it's so colorful! Woohoo! Yeah! I love trampolines! Hey, since we're learning about how to take care of animals today, why don't you guess which animal I'm thinking of? One that really likes to jump. Yeah, it can put its babies in its pouch right here. And you find a lot of them in Australia! Woohoo! Yeah! Look at me! I'm a kangaroo! Will you jump like a kangaroo with me? Woohoo! Yeah! Woo! Boing! 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 <laughs> okay, I have another animal for you to guess. 
Okay, a lot of them are green around the world, but here in Brazil, yeah, they're so colorful. And they're actually pretty poisonous. And the sound that these animals make is ribbit, ribbit. Yeah, a frog. And here in Brazil, they even have colorful poison dart frogs. Woohoo! Ribbit, ribbit, ribbit. Oh, frogs are so cool. I've had so much fun today. Whoa. Whoa. I should probably put on my shoes. I think I'm all done playing. All right, here's one shoe. And then here's two shoes. Wow, did you have fun with me? Yeah, I had fun with you too. I really enjoy taking care of animals and I also love to play. Yeah, whoa, check it out. Some water, I'm still super tired from playing. All that jumping and climbing, yeah, like animals. Oh, it's very important ah, to hydrate. Whoa! Today was so much fun taking care of all those animals. I sure do love animals, and it makes me so happy knowing that you love animals, and you take care of all the animals. And if you have pets, you make sure that they're nice and healthy and happy. Oh! Mm. Well, this was so much fun, and if you want to watch more of my videos, all you have to do is search for my name! Please spell my name with me. Ready? <laughs> B-L-I-P-P-I, -P -I. Blippi. Good job. All right, see you again. This has been so much fun in Brazil. Bye-bye. <laughs> Whoa. Hey, it's me, Blippi, and today I'm at Woodland Park Zoo in Seattle, Washington. <laughs> I am so excited to learn about penguins. Animals. Yeah, these are penguins, and they're actually humble penguins. Oh, they are so cute. Hello. <laughs> these penguins, yeah, their native land is Peru and northern Chile. Yeah, that doesn't sound like a cold place. Those countries are actually really warm. So these penguins live basically in the desert. <laughs> is so soft. <laughs> yeah, since penguins are birds, they have a lot of feathers, and these feathers are really small and dense on its body. Oh, hey cutie. <laughs> and do you see its wings? Yeah, its wings actually are more like flippers because then they can swim super fast in the water. And actually, penguins actually can't even fly with their wings. That's okay, because you're a really good swimmer. <laughs> Oh, check it out. Do you see how this penguin doesn't have stripes? Yeah, there's just teeny little black dots. Hey, and the one right behind it, yeah, there's those big black stripes. That one is an adult. So front one is a child, and the back one is an adult. Whoa, hey. <laughs> They're almost the same size though. <laughs> how are you? Are you having a good day? <laughs> Cause I sure am. Do you see these penguins? Yeah, they look like cute pets, don't they? Yeah, but they're actually not. Penguins don't make good pets. Although they're nice, yeah, they're living at the zoo so we can take care of them and we can learn about them. And the more we learn about these cute humble penguins, the better we can take care of their cousins around the world. <laughs> Whoa, penguins? Yeah. We're behind the scenes at the aquarium, and we're gonna meet some penguins. Come on. Okay. 
Let's walk nice and slow and we'll be very quiet as well. Ooh. Hey, who are you? Hutch. Ooh, this is Hutch. Hey, and what do you do here? I work with the penguins and reptiles. Ooh, the penguins and the reptiles? Oh, do you see the penguins back there? Oh, are these your only two penguins here? Oh, no, we have more friends that are coming. Would you like to grab a toy? We're actually going to play with them. Sure. Okay, let's grab a toy and let's see some more penguins. Look over there. movement with their toys. So we have Violet that has already come over to say hi. It, it looks like it's enjoying my shadow, huh? That does happen. So penguins really like contrasting colors. They also can see colors really well. They have rods and cones in their eyes just like we do. Okay. They're kind of, although they're birds, they're kind of acting like kitty cats, huh? Just a little bit. They do like to play with a lot of different types of toys. And just like kitty cats, they tell us when they want to be touched. Okay. Huh, interesting. It's pretty cool. Hey, get a closer look. Oh, bye-bye. <laughs> but penguins are so silly. So where are these penguins from? These penguins are from South Africa. Hey. And we have 32 of them here. Wow, 32 penguins here. And these are from South Africa? Yes. Not Antarctica? Not Antarctica. They're actually one of several species of penguins that prefer the warm climate. Oh, okay. That's pretty cool. Interesting. Warm climate and penguins. I guess you learn something every day. <laughs> okay, let's take a seat right over here. And then Hutch is going to bring a penguin over. <laughs> I'm so excited. I get to touch a penguin. Ooh, hello. <laughs> okay, so I'm going to touch the penguin with two fingers gently on its back. Hey, are you ready? Here we go. Okay. Oh. It felt so soft. Did you know penguins have 70 feathers per square inch? Yeah, they're really small and really dense. Can I touch the game, Hutch? Yes, you can. Okay. Does that feel good? You like that? She's showing off for you. What does that mean when she shakes her head? So that means she's really happy, uh, and you might be her new boyfriend. Ooh. <laughs> I hope she doesn't want to kiss. <laughs> guys, we're getting ready to feed the penguins today. So we have some of their favorite fish. These are called ocean smell, also known as silver sides, because they have that silver stripe on their side. And I have herring, it's silver like an anchovy and sardines, just like they eat in the wild. Okay, you guys ready to eat? Even hungry. I'm going to try and feed the penguins. <laughs> All right. Whoa. Look at these fish. Whoa. If I was a penguin, I would sure want to eat this. <laughs> okay. Here you go. Oh. <laughs> Here you go, penguin. Here's another one. Hey, there you go. Oh. <laughs> that one must be really hungry. <laughs> okay. Here you go. All 
right. So these fish are a lot smaller. Here you go. Oh, perfect. You want another one? <laughs> Here's another one. Okay. <laughs> Excuse me, penguins. Here you go. Oh. <laughs> Here you go. Oh, you're hungry. <laughs> yeah. Fish are nice and healthy for these penguins. Ah. <laughs> All right. Yeah, just like how we eat fruits and vegetables. Yeah, they love fish. <laughs> um, how about you? You haven't had one? Oh, whoa, there's so many penguins that want food. <laughs> there you go. Oh, whoa. All right, there you go. That one right here is so hungry. They have gotten so many of the fish. Oh, here you go. <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> okay, penguins, get ready! It sure has been a lot of fun learning about penguins with you. But this is the end of this video. But if you want to watch more of my videos, all you have to do is search for my name. Will you spell my name with me? B-L-I-P-P-I -P -P -I, Flippy. Good job. All right. See you again. And today, I'm at the Phoenix Zoo in Phoenix, Arizona. Hey, I think you and I should learn about some animals today. Let's go. Whoa. Do you see that? That is a howler monkey. Yeah. Do you see it? Yeah, right there. That is Bilbo, named after Bilbo Baggins. <laughs> That's funny. Let's act like monkeys together. That's Lulu the rhinoceros. And Lulu is 21 years old. <laughs> yeah, Lulu, party! <laughs> yeah! That's a toucan. Did you see its big beak? Kind of looks like a banana. Let's check out another animal. Oh, whoa, look at this. Do you know what animal this is? Yeah, this is a tiger. Whoa, hello kitty. <laughs> whoa, come over here, turn around. Whoa, this is where the tigers live. Hey, and look at who it is over here. Looks like we're getting ready to do some training. See that? 
the tiger is doing exactly what he's saying. It looks like they're having so much fun. Target? Ooh, that was really cool. Did you see that? Hey, will you tell us why we just did that? Yeah, so uh, we train our animals so that um, they have the opportunity to make things easier for them and the staff. Ooh. So we don't train our animals to do tricks. Um, we do what we call behaviors. So for example, when I was having Jay target his nose to the end of this pole, um, it allowed me to move him to different positions so I could see different parts of his body. Um, having him stand up is not only impressive to see how big a tiger is, um, but it gives me the chance to see his underside. Because just like us, they can get injuries like cuts and bruises. So it lets me check up on his body to make sure he's still feeling good. Ooh, well thank you so much for showing me what you just showed me. You're very welcome. Alright, see you later. Thanks. <laughs> let's go see some more stuff. Do you see that animal? It's another cat. This is a jaguar. <laughs> Whoa. I have a pail of carrots and some tongs. And we just got told we need to feed the next animal. Come on. Ooh. Hey, check it out. These are cables that you have to be on this side of them. But we just got permission to head inside so we can feed the animals. Let's go. Okay, this is a short barrier. Interesting. That wasn't too hard to get in. Oh, I see the animal, look. Let's go through the trees. Whoa, hey look, look at the animal. We get a feed, check it out. Whoa, do you know what kind of animal this is? This is a tortoise. Let's feed the tortoises, yeah. Check this out, this is a carrot and I'm using tongs because tortoises have really strong jaws and might bite my finger off. Here you go. Whoa, oh, whoops, it slipped. <laughs> Here you go. Whoa, okay, would you like a little bit more? Yeah, okay, here you go. Oh, there you go. Whoa. This tortoise is about 550 pounds. Whoa, that is really heavy. Hey, and guess how old he is. Oh, he's 66 years old. Whoa, that's really old. Oh, hello. Hey, check this out. I'll pet this tortoise's head. Hello, how are you? Whoa, whoa, look, the tortoise is off the ground. Do you see that? Because that allows for all the bugs and everything to get away from its underneath area. Whoa, okay, let's go get some more carrots. Whoa, hello, how are you doing? Are you having a good day? Ooh, check it out. See this tortoise? This tortoise is a Galapagos tortoise, and it's a female. Oh, oh, there you go. Oh, and here comes the male. Whoa, do you see how big he is? Oh, I'm getting trapped. Okay, I'm gonna loop right around here. See how this one's a little smaller? And this one is bigger? Whoa, this is a female. 
and this is a male. Whoa, hey, do you two like each other? Yeah, you two look like your friends. <laughs> oh, would you like some more? Whoa! Whoa! <laughs> Good job! Oh, you dropped it! <laughs> hey, come a little closer! Okay, here you go. Alright. Open wide! Here comes the carrot! Whoa! There you go. Is that yummy? Hey, tortoises like carrots just like how I do. And carrots are nice and healthy. There you go. Whoa, you have a big mouth. Whoa, look, I'm giving this tortoise a scratch. See, how does that feel? Does that feel good? Yeah. Do you see how the tortoise is standing on its legs really high in the air? In the wild, they do this because a lot of times they have bugs underneath them. And this allows for the finches, which are birds, go, go, to fly underneath there and then eat all of the bugs underneath this tortoise. Yeah, but for now, he's standing on his legs because this feels really good. It's kind of like when a grown up gives you a back scratch. Yeah, I like when my mom gives me a back scratch. Yeah, how does this feel? You like that? Yeah. <laughs> okay, my turn. Okay, my turn. I'm ready. I'm ready. Oh no. Ooh, check this out. This is an armadillo. Okay, here you go. Run free. Whoa, look. An armadillo is one of the ambassador animals at the zoo. That means it's an animal that you can meet face to face. Whoa, hey, what are you doing? You want a treat? Armadillos love mealworms. Here you go. Uh-oh. Hey, come right over here. Here you go. Look, doesn't this armadillo look hard? Yeah, it is kind of hard. And it's not a shell. It's bone inside the armadillo's skin. Whoa. <laughs> okay. Ooh, this is Princess Buttercup. Ooh, all right. Here you go. Here you go, Princess Buttercup. Ooh, look at Princess Buttercup's pretty little nails. Whoa. Okay, run free. Animal. What kind of animal is this? This is an Indian crested porcupine. Whoa! Look at all of its spines. Are those spines? The big ones are just to make her look scary, but the dangerous ones are down by her tail. Oh, okay, down there. Whoa. And what is she doing right now? We're just enjoying some snacks. Ooh. She likes a lot of plants, so we've got her some biscuits, some yam, and some apple today. Ooh, that sounds pretty tasty, actually. Ooh. Let's take a closer look at the porcupine. Wow, you don't want to touch this animal on its tail. <laughs> This next area is really cool. Whoa, do you hear that? All these things are working really hard to keep this next area exactly like how the ocean is. Come here. Whoa, look at it. 
whoa, there's so many filters and, and other things. It's so cool. Okay, come over here. Let me show you what it's doing. Yeah, this is Stingray Bay. And they're training the stingrays to do some pretty cool tricks. If you come to this zoo, you can use a flat, gentle hand and touch the stingrays on their back. But they're letting me go inside. <laughs> I'm so excited. Okay, first, I need to take off my shoes. One shoe. Whoa, two shoes. Okay, let's put those there. Can't forget about the socks because I'm going to put these on. Whoa, they're like water socks or water shoes. Okay, let's put them on. All right. Okay. Okay. <laughs> I'm ready. Here we go. You have to be nice and smooth and slow so you don't scare them. Oh, oh the water's nice and cold. Okay. Whoa. <laughs> okay. Hi. How are you? Good. How are you? Good. What's your name? My name is Mary and this is Kelsey. We work here at the Phoenix Zoo. Woohoo! So what are you doing right now? So right now we're giving breakfast to our stingrays and we're checking them to make sure everybody's healthy and happy this morning. Ooh, that sounds like fun. Can I help? Sure. Would you like to feed some? Ooh, yeah. Let's feed the stingrays. Okay. So Look at them. They have <laughs> shrimp and smelt. So you can take a couple and you can put it in your hand. Okay. Check out the food. Whoa! Looks so tasty. Okay, I put it in my hand. You're gonna hold it like an ice cream cone. Okay. Ooh, I like ice cream. <laughs> okay, just like that. Put it nice and deep into the water. They're gonna swim over your hand and they're gonna suck it out of your hand like a vacuum. Okay. Okay, here you go. Whoa! <laughs> Whoa! Whoa! Look at that one. So you've got a uh, blue spotted ribbon tail sitting on your feet. <laughs> okay. Do I go deeper in the water? Let's see what we can do. Oh, there Come you on, go. guys. Oh! I did it! Look! It's gone! <laughs> it sucked it right out of my hand. Can I do it again? You can. can. Oh. oh, thank you. <laughs> they suck the food right out of my hand. It's kind of like, have you ever put a vacuum on your hand and then the vacuum sucks on your hand? That's kind of how it feels like when it's sucking the food out of your hand. Whoa! <laughs> that one just swam through my legs. <laughs> Whoa! Look at them. So they're getting used to you now. So they can yeah. feel who you are by your heartbeat. Okay. They're understanding that you're not going to hurt them. And so they're coming closer and closer Whoa. as they're getting more and more comfortable with you. Yeah. Look at them. Hello. Whoa. <laughs> <laughs> that scared me. What happened there? They just got a little bit excited. Okay. Excited, not scared? Yeah. Okay. Because I kind of got scared. <laughs> But that's okay. They kind of seem really gentle. Oh, whoa, whoa, there they go again. <laughs> Look at how wet I'm getting. <laughs> All right, let's feed some more. Hello, look at all of these stingrays. Whoa, <laughs> all right, bye-bye stingrays. Ooh, now we're gonna take a camel ride. <laughs> Have fun, Flippy. Thank you. Come on. Look, this is the top of the camel. See the hump? I'm gonna sit on top of it. Whoa! Now I'm on top of a camel. Okay, here we go. Check it out. Whee! Whoa! Hey! Look! I'm on the hump of the camel! Whoa! This is a nice camel! This is a dromedary camel! 
it's really high up here. Whoa, <laughs> I'm having so much fun. <laughs> Wee! Hello. See the hump of the camel? They store fat in here. And they can actually go about seven months without eating food. Or three to four weeks without drinking any water. That's pretty impressive, huh? Whoa! Whee! <laughs> Whoa! some pretty long legs, huh? And it has four legs. And you and I have two. Whoa. All right, this is pretty fun. Whoa, <laughs> that was awesome. Thank you very much. Yeah, you're welcome. All right, okay, let's go see some more animals. Ooh, now we're behind the scenes of the native Arizona exhibit. Ooh, check it out. Look, some tools. Hey, what does this look like? Kind of looks like a golf club. <laughs> but actually, see how it has a hook? It's used to handle certain types of reptiles, like a snake. Okay, but I'm not gonna use that because I'm not a trained professional. Ooh, check it out. Wow, some aquariums. <laughs> the fish are on the other side. We're behind the scenes. Whoa, look at this room. Whoa, this is a box. And this is where a snake lives. Let's read what kind it is. Rattlesnake. Venomous? <gasps> okay, I don't think I should handle that one. Because, like I said, I'm not a trained professional. <laughs> Let's find a snake that I can handle. Oh, this room's pretty cool. Whoa, there's so many cages right here. Whoa, what are these? These are snake sheds. Wow, every snake sheds its skin every couple months. Look at that, and they're all in one piece. Look, doesn't that look like a snake? Yeah, that's pretty cool, huh? Okay, okay. I'll keep these right here. Okay. Yeah, this one looks like a good snake to handle. I'm handling a snake. Whoa, and look at the color of this snake. It's orange and white and black. Whoa. I used to be afraid of snakes when I was a child, but now I'm not. But some snakes you definitely don't want to hold. So if you ever see a snake in the wild, just to be safe, you probably shouldn't try and hold it like this. Okay, whoa! Look, are you having fun, snake? Whee! Hello! Hey! Whoa, look at it! Whoa! It's so intrigued with the camera. Whoa! This is awesome. We're behind the scenes of another reptile area. Whoa, there's so many cool tanks in here with so many unique creatures. Whoa. <laughs> hey, whoa, look right here. Oh, hey, there's someone over here. Come here. Whoa, hey, what are you doing? Just getting ready to check out one of our horned lizards. Did you want to hold him? Yeah, a horned lizard, that's cool. Okay. Okay, thank you. Whoa, look! This is a horned lizard. Check out its horns. Wow. <laughs> he's so cute. Whoa. And he's just hanging out. 
Okay, well, thank you very much. You're welcome. Okay, there you go. That was awesome. Good job. Let's go. Hello, hello. <laughs> Whoa. Oh. A lion? Ooh, an elephant. <laughs> Whoa, look. <laughs> this is a gorilla. <laughs> and some snakes? Yeah, I gotta hold a snake. Whoa. Isn't that cool? Whoa. <laughs> Whoa, there's so many cool things in here. Okay, follow me. Ooh, there's even a dinosaur. A Tyrannosaurus Rex. Interesting. Well, hey, that was so much fun learning about animals with you at the zoo. This is the end of this video. But if you want to watch more of my videos, all you have to do is search for my name. Will you spell my name with me? <laughs> Ready? B-L-I-P-P-I. -P -P -I. Blippi. Good job. All right. See you later. <laughs> hey, it's me, Blippi. And today, we're here at the San Diego Zoo Safari Park in Escondido, California. <laughs> yeah. Hey. Do you know what a safari is? <laughs> yeah, it's an outdoor adventure where you can see all kinds of amazing animals. <laughs> and today is a really special day because we're going to search for a platypus. Yeah, this is the only place that you can see a platypus outside of Australia. <gasps> I am so excited, come on. So excited to go on a wildlife safari! Oh, and we get to ride in this amazing vehicle. It's called a caravan. <laughs> oh, look at it. It has really big tires and wheels and shocks. <laughs> yeah, that's so if we hit any bumps or holes in the ground, we'll be nice and smooth riding in the back. <laughs> oh, and it's Karen, the driver. Hi, Karen. <laughs> Whoa, and look, there are so many amazing things on a caravan. We have gas tanks and <laughs> a barrel for water. Whoa, and look at this. It's the back of the caravan. <laughs> yeah, this, this right here, that's where we're gonna sit. So let's go sit inside. <laughs> oh, it's a person. Let's go say hi. Hi. Hi, Blippi. It's me, Blippi. <laughs> um, what's your name? Oh, my name's Marco. I'm a wildlife care specialist here at the Safari Park. Oh, it's nice to meet you, Marco. Well, we are really excited to go on a safari. All Can right. Can sit inside? Yeah, definitely. Let's go. <laughs> Let's follow Marco. <laughs> Whoa. Look at this place. There is a canopy over our heads. Yeah. So keep us dry and away from the sun. And so many seats. Woo. <laughs> we're ready for a safari. All right, we're almost there. Actually, all you need is special safari gear. And look, we got some for you right here. Oh, look at that. Special safari gear. Whoa, safari gear is so much fun. <laughs> look, we have binoculars. Oh, we're seeing really far away. Woo! <laughs> and uh, we have a hat to keep the sun out of our eyes. <laughs> and don't forget to drink lots of water. <laughs> okay, it looks like we're all geared up 
and ready for the safari. <laughs> All right, excellent, you look great. All right, Karen, we're ready to go. <laughs> this is gonna be so much fun. <laughs> <laughs> you see what kind of animal this is? <laughs> oh, they are giraffes! <laughs> and they are so cute! <laughs> oh, it is so much fun being on a safari! <laughs> hmm, do you see that one giraffe? Look, it's really small! Huh. Hmm. Marco, why is that one giraffe so much smaller than the others? You know, that giraffe, Lippy, is actually one of our newest babies. She's 16 days old. Oh, it really is a baby. <laughs> How tall is the giraffe? Oh, well, you know, they can grow throughout their lifetime, actually. So she is about six feet at the moment, but she's going to keep growing. This is the tallest mammal on planet Earth. Whoa, <laughs> this baby giraffe is a baby, but it's as tall as me. <laughs> That's pretty amazing. <laughs> wow, you're so, so pretty and so tall. <laughs> hey, it looks like they have these little things on their head. <laughs> it looks like hair or little horns. What are those? Yeah, actually, they're called ossicones, actually. Ossicones? Whoa, <laughs> that's a really cool word. What's an ossicone? Well, think of it sort of like, like horns for a giraffe, basically. Oh, wow. Those ossicones are pretty cool. <laughs> oh, they're so cool. Do you see what colors they are? Yeah, it looks like they're a golden brown and white. <laughs> yeah, they have a really interesting pattern all over them. <laughs> oh, hmm. hmm. It also looks like they have big ears. Can giraffes hear really well? They do, they hear very, very well. And eyesight's pretty amazing too. You know, there's other predators out there where they mm -hmm. live, so they gotta watch out. Whoa, <laughs> that is so cool. They can hear really well and see all over the safari. Oh, <laughs> I think giraffes are so amazing. <laughs> oh, hello giraffe. <laughs> oh, look, that giraffe, he's looking at us. I think he's just checking us out. Ooh, he's saying, hi, Blippi. <laughs> hi. <laughs> Whoa, they also have funny looking mouths. What kind of food does a giraffe eat? You know, they love leaves, plant material, especially having such a long neck, eating all the plants at the very tops of the trees. Oh, huh, that makes sense. Yeah, giraffes are really tall with really long necks, so they can eat the tops of trees. <laughs> wow, giraffes sure are pretty amazing. Hmm, but they're not a platypus. Hmm, let's keep looking for some other amazing animals. Maybe we'll find a platypus. <laughs> you won't believe what really cool animal Marco and I found on our safari. Come look. Whoa, <laughs> look at it. What kind of animal is this? Oh, these are called fringe eared oryx. Whoa, fringed eared oryx. Never heard of an animal like that before. Whoa, do you see? They have really big horns on their head. Kind of like a unicorn, but instead of one horn, they have one, two horns. <laughs> wow, they're amazing. Oh, whoa. And look, they have kind of funny markings on their face. They do. Yeah, right now, we think that's actually to help them ward off predators out there. It's almost like having a permanent Halloween mask. Whoa, <laughs> sounds spooky. Ooh. <laughs> wow, Ooh, they're so cool. And they're, they're pretty big. Can, can these oryx run fast? Oh, they can run very fast. I mean, they <laughs> need to to get away from predators. Mm -hmm. <laughs> wow, just a family of oryx. <laughs> Oh. <laughs> oh, and do you see? Their ears are so funny. They have dots in the middle of their ears. Whoa, <laughs> it looks like an eye. <laughs> That's a really good observation. That's what we think they have them for, to help confuse predators out there so they can't sneak up and surprise them. Whoa, these orcs look really smart. That is so cool. 
<laughs> well, <laughs> they're just hanging out, being friendly. <laughs> well, it was nice to meet you. Hello. <laughs> <gasps> These orcs were really interesting, but they're still not a platypus. <laughs> Let's keep looking. <laughs> Flippy, come look at these guys. Oh, okay. Whoa, look at what animal Marco found. Whoa, <laughs> they're so big. <laughs> Marco, what kind of animal is this? Uh, you're looking at a southern white rhino. Wow, a southern white rhino. <laughs> you see, look, they have really big horns. Whoa, <laughs> why does a rhino like this have a big horn? Yeah, those horns help them protect themselves out there in Africa against all those predators out there. Wow, it is so cool and so big. <laughs> Whoa, and look, look, they have really teeny tiny eyes, but they have really big noses. <laughs> hmm, I bet that means they have a really good sense of smell. <laughs> yeah, yeah, you're absolutely right, Pulpy. That's a good observation. You know, these animals, excellent sense of smell. Really, really good hearing as well. You see how those ears can move around all about so they can always hear what's going on around them. Wow, that is amazing. <laughs> Their ears are so fuzzy. Whoa, <laughs> look, you see all the little hairs and fuzzy parts? <laughs> Rhinos are so cute. Oh, and so hungry. Oh, do they like to eat anything else other than hay? Oh, they love the all sorts of plant material. They love grass. And these guys can weigh three to 4,000 pounds, sometimes even more. So they gotta eat all that food. Whoa, three to 4,000 pounds? <laughs> That's a lot of hay. <laughs> hey, <laughs> wow. They sure do like eating. Yeah, and they are really big. <laughs> hey, do you know what color these rhinos are? Yeah. They're the color gray. <laughs> I bet they stay cool because is there dirt on their backs? That's absolutely right. Yeah, they love to wallow out there, get some mud on their backs. It <laughs> helps with sunblock like that safari hat you were wearing. They don't oh. need the hat, they got their mud. Wow, it's so amazing. Yeah, they roll around in the dirt and they stay cool. Yeah, yeah. dirt, dust on their back, kind of like my official safari hat. <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> Well, I think we should see some more animals, Marco. Yeah, I think you're right. These rhinos, they're not platypuses. Mm -mm. <laughs> Thanks, Marco, for taking us on an awesome safari. <laughs> yeah, no problem, let's go see some more animals. Okay, let's go. <laughs> Whew, looking for a platypus is hard work. I've been running so fast. Hey. Do you know what other animal likes to run really fast? <laughs> yeah, a cheetah likes to run really fast. They are the fastest land animal and they can run up to 70 miles per hour <laughs> and reach speeds of 40 miles per hour in three steps. Whoa, <laughs> hey, I have an idea. How about I race a cheetah? <laughs> yeah. Let's see who will win the race. <laughs> Whoa! Did you see how fast that cheetah was? <laughs> it was amazing. Well, better keep looking for this platypus. I'm so excited to see this snake. What kind of snake is this? This is called a Burmese python. Whoa, this Burmese python is so big. <laughs> Whoa, <laughs> what's its name? Uh, this is Julius Squeezer. Julius Squeezer, <laughs> so silly. That's a cool name. Oh, this snake is amazing. And look, it has this really pretty pattern with all types of different shades of brown and white and gold. 
Why is it colored like this? Yeah, well, this helps him get his food out in the wild. So this is what we call a sit and wait predator. So that's exactly what he did. As he sits, he blends in with all the leaf litter and just waits until something yummy walks by and then he got the snack for that day. Woo! <laughs> wow, that is so cool. Hmm. Oh, Julia Squeezer. <laughs> How's it going? Hello? Whoa. Hey, it looks like he's looking at us now. <laughs> Whoa, he keeps poking his tongue out. Why is Julia Squeezer doing that? <laughs> you know, he's actually tasting the air. So he has an organ in his mouth called the Jacobson's organ, which helps him actually detect prey. So he can pick up set particles in the air to help follow his prey out there. Whoa, that is really amazing. <laughs> it sure would be silly if I was walking around with my tongue out. <laughs> I'm not a snake. <laughs> Whoa, but this snake is so cool. Hmm. What type of snake is this? A Burmese python. And you know, the differences between the python and the boa, sometimes people get them confused. Oh, yeah. yeah. Python and boa. Yeah. Whoa, what's the difference between a python and a boa? Oh, that's a great question, but, but you know, pythons are generally found in the old world, so Asia, Africa, Australia, Ooh. plus they lay eggs. Now the boa can be found in the old world and the new world, but what boas do instead, they carry their eggs inside of them. So people tend to call it a live birth, but really they're just keeping their eggs inside. <laughs> Whoa, hello. <laughs> wow, Julia Squeezer is so friendly. He keeps saying hello. <laughs> wow, snakes are so amazing. They're so good at moving, even though they don't have any arms or legs. Yeah. <laughs> Whoa, <laughs> hello. <laughs> oh, I'd like to give you a hug, but I feel like they have really powerful hugs. <laughs> they really do, yeah. This predator is a constrictor, so he mm -hmm. just holds his prey super, super tight. And that's a, a good thing you noted too, actually, Blippi. You know, these animals, uh, Julius, he's an ambassador. He represents his wild brothers and sisters, but we definitely want the kids out there to know you don't want to be handling a wild snake like this. We are trained professionals here at the safari park. <laughs> Yeah, you don't want to be handling a snake like this without a professional wildlife care specialist. <laughs> like my good friend Marco. Oh, <laughs> but he sure is beautiful. Wow. Hello. <laughs> he likes my shoe quite a bit. <laughs> he does. <laughs> What's well, a pretty nice shoe, I gotta say. <laughs> <laughs> Whoa. Well, thanks so much for saying hello, Julia Squeezer. Bye bye. <laughs> hey. What other animals will we be able to see today? Oh, next we're gonna show you one of my favorite birds, the fastest animal on planet Earth. Oh, the fastest animal alive? Oh, I can't wait to see it. <laughs> okay, let's go see. Bye-bye. <laughs> wow, I am so excited to see the next animal ambassador. <laughs> We saw so many amazing animals. Uh, what animal are we gonna see next? One of my favorites, his name is Nelson, called the Lanner Falcon. Ooh, Nelson, and he's a falcon. <laughs> wow, does he fly in the air and he's, he, is he pretty fast? Oh, very fast. They broke the record fastest animal on the planet over 240 miles per hour. And today I'm gonna be sharing with you a hunting flight. Wow, I can't wait to see the hunting flight. 240 miles per hour, that's faster than a car. Okay, I think we're all ready to see the hunting flight. All right. Okay, keep your eyes open for Nelson. <laughs> this is so exciting. Whoa. Whoa, look, Marco is swinging around some meat. Okay. Nelson, good boy. Good. Good. Whoa, did you see that? Whoa. Nelson caught the meat midair. <laughs> That's pretty amazing. Hey, let's go take a closer look. <laughs> wow, I am so excited to see Nelson up close. Birds, they're pretty amazing. And this bird is so powerful and so fast. <laughs> Whoa. Yeah, so beautiful. Well, right now we wanna wait because Nelson is finishing up his meal, <laughs> but we'll be able to see him real soon. 
cool. Look, yeah. He's on Marco's glove. Yeah, that glove helps to protect his hand because Nelson has really sharp, powerful talons. <laughs> Whoa, look, Marco's coming this way. We should go say hi. But we need to be careful. We don't want to scare Nelson. <laughs> He's just finishing his food right now. Whoa. <laughs> we'll get him a little closer for you, but so that was just an example of the amazing hunting flight that they do out there. Oh. Wow. Nelson is a really amazing bird. <laughs> He's so beautiful. <laughs> his eyes look so big. Can he see really well? well they see so well, you can see over a mile away, especially when you're flying in the air. That's a really good tool to have. Wow, that is one amazing bird. <laughs> well, we better let Nelson finish his lunch. <laughs> hey, maybe we can see some more birds. Yeah, that sounds great, Bumpy. I'll see you there. Okay, I'll see you soon. Oh, that was amazing. We saw so many different ambassador animals. And now we get to see even more birds. <laughs> Let's go meet up with Marco. Okay, let's go. <laughs> Whoa. We're still looking for a platypus. But <laughs> Nelson was such an amazing animal. I want to see what other birds Marco works with. <laughs> oh, hey, and there's Marco. Hi, Marco. <laughs> hey, Blippi. Marco, what other animals do you have to show us today? Uh, well, I want to show you more raptors, just like Nelson, but he hunts in a different way, which I'm going to show you right now. Okay, yeah. I'm so excited. All right, here we go. Oh, I can't wait to see this bird. was amazing. Marco, what kind of animal was that? Oh, that was a secretary bird. So just like Nelson, the lantern falcon, both found in Africa and both raptors, but they hunt in a very different way. So I'm so happy to share that with you. And not only that, he's a pretty big raptor, but raptors come in all different shapes and sizes. So we have another one we're gonna show you right now. Follow me this way. Okay. Whoa, I wonder what bird we'll see next. <laughs> that bird was so big. <laughs> come on. Hmm. Keep your eyes out for another bird. <laughs> oh, look at this. Hello. Hi. Whoa, that last bird was so big. But this looks like a really teeny tiny owl. It's so cute. <laughs> oh, what kind of owl is this? She is called an Eastern Screech Owl. Wow. This owl is so tiny. <laughs> Who would have thought? There are really big birds and really small birds. Whoa, the feathers are so amazing and beautiful. Hmm, do these feathers remind you of another animal we saw today? <laughs> yeah, just like the snake. Yeah, look, hmm. this little owl has camouflage feathers so she can blend in with the tree. <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> What's this owl's name? Her name is Rue. Whoa. Hi, Rue. <laughs> You're so cute. Whoa. Her eyes are really big. <laughs> Why's that? Right? So she is a nocturnal predator. That means she hunts at night. So she's going to use those really big eyeballs to help her see really well at nighttime. Help her catch her little prey item. Whoa. You remember that word? Yeah. Nocturnal. That means they're not awake in the day like us, but they're awake at night. <laughs> wow, Rue is so amazing. <laughs> yep. Well, all the birds we've learned about really like eating meat. Do all birds eat meat? Actually, no, Blippi. We have some animals that are omnivores that like eating two different things, meat and plant material. And we got one to share with you right now. Oh, wow, yeah, that's amazing. An omnivore eats meat like a carnivore and Vegetables and plants like an herbivore. Oh, 
That's a lot of big words. <laughs> but let's go see this bird Marco house. Come on. All right, let's go. <laughs> Look at that. Whoa. Look at it. This bird is so big. <laughs> and colorful. Whoa. Hello. <laughs> <laughs> wow. Oh, what kind of bird is this? This is a West African or East African gray crown crane. And you can see that by the gray on the side of her body here. Whoa. A uh, West African? Whoa, wait, did you see that one? <laughs> oh, yeah. East African gray crown crane. East African gray crown crane? <laughs> That's a really long name. <laughs> but a really beautiful bird deserves a really cool, beautiful name. <laughs> Whoa. And what's that on their head? It looks like spikes, like an echidna. <laughs> yeah, you actually, a lot of people think that, but you know, those are actually tightly woven feathers, so they're not sharp at all. Just like that big, beautiful wingspan, every feather is modified for very specific things. She has feathers for flying, she's got feathers to keep her warm, she's even got feathers to attract the mate, but those feathers, it's a good symbol that she's an adult crown crane. Wow, <laughs> a grown-up. <laughs> Whoa, does this crown crane have a family? She does have a family. They're very social animals. And she is like the other ambassadors we talked about for her wild brothers and sisters. So we're part of her flock here at the bird show in the bird department. And she helps connect people with wildlife. Wow, these birds are so amazing. <laughs> Thanks for sharing so many amazing animals with us. <laughs> Thanks, Marco. Yeah, no problem, Blippi. I'll see you later. All right. <laughs> Look at where we are. <laughs> it feels like we're in the jungle. Woo! <laughs> hmm, I wonder what kind of animal lives here. Hmm, that's not a platypus. <laughs> Whoa! You see what kind of animal that is? It's a Sumatran tiger. Yeah, they are really big cats that are really powerful. <laughs> yeah. Whoa! Look! He's coming this way. Hello. <laughs> this tiger's name is Rakan. <laughs> and it looks like he's getting ready for lunch. Yeah. Tigers, they love to eat. They like to eat meat because they're carnivores. Mm -hmm. Carnivores, that means an animal that likes to eat meat. And they have a really big teeth that help them do it. Front teeth, ah, they grab onto their food. And back teeth, that help chew the food. <laughs> Woo! It's really good to chew up your food, especially if it's healthy food. Woo! Woo! <laughs> well, maybe he's not gonna eat lunch today. He's probably feeling a little bit sleepy and having just a lazy day relaxing in his habitat. <laughs> it sure looks like fun to be a tiger. <laughs> Whoa! Look at him walk. Whoa, <laughs> he was moving really fast. <laughs> wow, <laughs> it is so fun seeing so many amazing animals. <laughs> but we still need to find the platypus. <laughs> We're gonna find him, I just know it. Look at who I have here. This is B, <laughs> and B's my friend. <laughs> Whoa, yeah, B is a Bennett's wallaby. Yeah, a wallaby. Wallaby's kind of like a small kangaroo, and she loves tasty treats. She's eating some tasty leaves. It's called Ruya. Ooh, <laughs> she is so happy. Whoa, <laughs> look. Wallabies and kangaroos, look, they have really big feet and they love treats. Ooh, <laughs> Ooh <laughs> that was a treat. <laughs> yeah, look, really big feet and a really big toe. Yeah, they have three toes. One, two, three. <laughs> Whoa, <laughs> she's having fun eating these leaves. Hey, look, do you see right here? 
She has some really big teeth. She has two top teeth, two bottom teeth, but are really big incisors. <laughs> so she can grab the gruya and tear it off and munch it up. <laughs> Ooh, she's so cute. I think she had a lot of that, so maybe we can give her some sweet potato. <laughs> yeah, wallabies, they're herbivores, which means they really like leafy greens and sweet potatoes. Whoa, <laughs> you want a sweet potato? Mm. Do you want some lettuce? <gasps> mm. Took a little nibble. <laughs> I think she wants some treats. <laughs> okay, I'll give her another treat because she's being so good. <laughs> Whoa. Do you see this? Look, B has a really big tail. Hey, B. <laughs> Whoa, did you see that? Yeah, B likes to hop. Hop, hop. <laughs> Ooh, there's a treat. <laughs> I like to hop too. Hey, let's hop like a wallaby. Whoop. <laughs> Hey, B, do you want another treat? Whoa! <laughs> wow. <laughs> Wallabies are amazing animals. Yeah, and they're marsupials, <laughs> which means they have a pouch. Whoa, <laughs> that is so cool. Well, maybe we can see if we can find a kangaroo. They gotta be around here somewhere. Let's go. <laughs> <laughs> Whoa, look at what it is. They're Western gray kangaroos. <laughs> yeah, they're just like B the wallaby, except they're not wallabies, <laughs> they're kangaroos. Mm -hmm. They're both marsupials, but kangaroos are a lot bigger than a wallaby. <laughs> Whoa, let's go see. They want to nibble on some gruya. Come on. Hello. <laughs> hey, do you want a tasty treat? Some gruya. Hey, isn't this really yummy? You want some of this? Whoa. Maybe they want some hibiscus leaves. <laughs> they really like hibiscus leaves. Whoa, look at them. Whoa, these kangaroos are a lot bigger. Yeah, you see their ears? Their ears are so big, so they can hear really well. <laughs> and look, their feet are even bigger than bees. Yeah, a kangaroo is so much bigger, and their feet are so much stronger that they can go up to 30 miles per hour. Whoa! That's really fast. <laughs> hey, maybe they want some lettuce. Whoa, yeah, or maybe, hmm. Well, we don't want to get too close because they don't like if we get too close. <laughs> hey, look, a little sweet potato. <laughs> Whoa, <laughs> did you see their teeth? <laughs> really good for munching on sweet potatoes. <laughs> Whoa. They're so cute and cuddly. Hey, and do you notice something? Look, it's the pouch. Yeah, it's the kangaroo pouch right by their legs. <laughs> Whoa, and that's where little Joey's hmm, baby kangaroos like to hang out. Yeah, they grow up in the pouch. Whoa, <laughs> I think I'm gonna give them some more treats. Hey, there's a lettuce. Isn't that so yummy? <laughs> really yummy. And healthy. <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> that was so much fun getting to see some Western gray kangaroos. <laughs> well, we still haven't found our platypus yet. Maybe we can keep looking and we'll find the platypus. <laughs> let's, let's go hop to find the platypus like a kangaroo. <laughs> Whoa, 
Look at this place. <laughs> I wonder what kind of animal lives here. <laughs> Let's find out. Oh, unique and elusive. Hmm. <laughs> that means whatever animal lives here is really special. <laughs> Let's see what it says. Hmm. This animal has a bill like a duck and lays eggs. Hmm has the body of an otter and the tail like a beaver. Hmm. <gasps> it's a platypus. <laughs> yeah. We found where the platypus lives. Whoa. It's really dark, but I know we can find it. Come on. Whoa. We found the platypus. <laughs> Look at him swimming around. His bill looks just like a duck. <laughs> and his body like a little otter. Whoa! And look at his tail. It looks just like a beaver's tail. <laughs> so cool! Oh, look! He's swimming under a log. <laughs> he loves to swim. Woo! Hello! Woo! We made it outside! That was amazing. We got to see the platypus swimming around. <laughs> we did it. Thanks for helping me find him. <laughs> okay, I'll see you around. <laughs> I had so much fun going on a safari with you. We saw so many amazing animals. Hey, what was your favorite animal we saw today? <laughs> I like that one too. <laughs> well, this is the end of this video. But if you want to watch more of my videos, all you have to do is search for my name. Hey, will you spell my name with me? <laughs> okay, here we go. B L I P P I. Blippi. Good job. Well, I'll see you soon. Bye bye. Tweet, 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 tweet. Woo. Rawr. <laughs> <laughs> hey, it's me, Flippy, and today we're here at the San Diego Zoo in San Diego, California. <laughs> I love pretending to be animals. <laughs> Do you like to pretend to be animals too? <laughs> well, I am so excited because today we get to see real animals. <laughs> I wonder what kind of animals we'll find. Let's go find out. Come on. <laughs> hey, whoa, look at where I am. I'm a seal. Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> whoa. Whoa. <laughs> whoa. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> whoa, that was really fun being a seal. Hey, look at this. Look at this amazing habitat. Hmm, I wonder what kind of animal lives here. Polar bears, whoa! <laughs> They're so big. Whoa, hello polar bears. <laughs> Woo, it looks like these polar bears are having fun in the water. Yeah, polar bears are some amazing animals and they usually live in really cold climates like Alaska or Canada. <laughs> yeah, but these live right here at the zoo. Well, polar bears that live in Alaska where it's really cold build up a lot of fat and blubber. But these guys, <laughs> they like to eat all kinds of things, so they stay nice and cool. Oh, they're so amazing. Look at them all. <laughs> Look, you can see he has two paws and two really big feet. <laughs> Whoa! Hey, did you know that polar bear's fur isn't white? Mm -mm. No, it's clear. Yeah, and their skin is black. Whoa, <laughs> who would have thought? They look white. <laughs> hmm, I wonder what they're all looking at. I know, they're probably looking for their favorite food. 
melons. <laughs> yeah, these polar bears love food, especially sweet treats and vegetables. <laughs> He's snacking on some lettuce. Do you see their mouths? Come here. Oh, see, they have really powerful jaws <laughs> and really big teeth. Oh, and did you know that polar bears can smell really well? Yeah, so they can smell for their food. They can even smell through snow. Whoa! <laughs> Whoa! It's a cantaloupe. Yeah, a cantaloupe. Just like you or I would eat. <laughs> but it looks like. Whoa! <laughs> he got it! <laughs> Look! He's munching on a cantaloupe. They're so sweet and healthy. <laughs> Cannonball! Woo! <laughs> I was being a cantaloupe. <laughs> This bear right here is over 10 feet tall. It stands on its back legs. That's taller than me. And these animals here, yeah, these three polar bears, they were rescued by the San Diego Zoo so they can live and eat all the cantaloupe and leafy greens that they want. <laughs> these are some amazing creatures. <laughs> where we are. <laughs> Whoa! Look, it's a polar bear. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> Whoa, this polar bear is so big. Yeah, this is the biggest polar bear here, Kaluk. Whoa. <laughs> yeah, Kaluk loves to swim. Polar bears are really good swimmers. Yeah, to get their food or to swim through the Arctic seas. Mm -hmm. And they can hold their breath for a really long time. <laughs> Whoa, look, he's just floating in the water. <laughs> Whoa, hello. <laughs> Ooh, so much yummy lettuce. Well, I'll see you later, Kaluk. <laughs> I think Kaluk wants to go play with the other polar bears. Hey, I have an idea. How about you and I go find some other animals? <laughs> I am so excited to see what we can learn. <laughs> Whoa, it's an elephant. <laughs> yeah, and this elephant's name is Mary. Mary came to say hello. Come on. Mary is amazing and is an Asian elephant. She's so big! <laughs> oh, and these are my two friends, Craig and Emily. <laughs> They're professional wildlife care specialists. <laughs> yeah, that means they take care of Mary. <laughs> Whoa, you see what they're doing? Look. Oh, they are doing physical therapy with Mary. That's because Mary is a really old Asian elephant. <laughs> really old, 57. Whoa. <laughs> Whoa. Really good at stretching. So much fun to stretch like an elephant. Because Mary's an Asian elephant, she doesn't have any tusks. No tusks. And Mary is really hairy. <laughs> Whoa. And you can see, not only is Mary hairy, but her skin has some dust and dirt in it. Yeah, that keeps Mary cool. Her wrinkly skin, she can put some dirt in. Keeps her nice and cool in the sun. She doesn't like to be really hot and sweaty. Mm -mm. <laughs> hey, do you notice what's in Emily's mouth? Yeah, look, it's a little silver thing. Did you hear that? 
<laughs> Let's listen again. It's a whistle. And the whistle tells Mary, good job. <laughs> you're doing so great. And because you're doing so great, I'm going to give you a treat, a tasty apple. <laughs> Keep listening for the whistle. Did you hear it? <laughs> Mary's doing so good. Whoa, look. Mary's trunk picked up another apple. <laughs> Did you notice something? Yeah. The end of the trunk for an Asian elephant, it doesn't have two fingers. No, or five fingers like us. No, it has one finger and another part that looks just like the palm of your hand. So Mary can pick up food or grab a tasty apple. <laughs> These elephants are amazing creatures. <laughs> it's so fun to watch. Hey, can you name all the parts of an elephant with me? Okay, hmm, let's think. The trunk, <laughs> the really big ears, Woo! <laughs> four legs, one, two, three, four. <laughs> and look, Mary has a tail. Whoa! <laughs> I love acting like an elephant. They are so amazing. Whoa, <laughs> it's so tall. <laughs> Whoa, now it's time to give Mary some food. <laughs> yeah, Mary loves to eat all kinds of things, but her diet consists of cucumbers. Whoa, cucumber slices and apples. <laughs> yeah, it's also important that we feed Mary some bran and mineral oil. Mm, <laughs> that doesn't sound as tasty, tasty as an apple, but it's really healthy for Mary. <laughs> and we gotta keep Mary healthy. Whoa, and look at this, come here. You see what Emily's doing? Yeah, Emily is giving Mary an extra special treat. <laughs> an extra special treat, raisins. <laughs> yeah, if Mary's done really good job or done something really special, we give her raisins. She loves raisins. Oh, it's her favorite treat. <laughs> hmm. Hey, maybe Emily will let me give Mary some raisins. <laughs> Emily, is it okay if I give? Yeah. Okay. Whoa, <laughs> that was so awesome. <laughs> Look where we are. Whoa, look, it's a penguin. <laughs> Hello. And this penguin's name is Dot. Yeah, Dot is a South African penguin and is really cute. <laughs> hey, yeah, look, he has a really long beak. <laughs> and is the colors black and white. Hmm, wait a minute. We're in San Diego. We're not near the snow. It's not very cold out. <laughs> That's because these penguins are temperate penguins, which means they like warmer weather. So it's really comfortable outside right now. <laughs> Whoa. Hello, Dot. <laughs> Look, she's so cute. <laughs> hey, did you know penguins are birds too? Yeah, they lay eggs, they have feathers, mm, but they can't fly. Mm -mm. They can't fly, but they're really good swimmers. They're really fast swimmers too, and they like to waddle. Hey, will you waddle like a penguin with me? <laughs> okay. <laughs> Great job waddling like a penguin with me. Well, this was so much fun learning about penguins. <laughs> I bet we can see some other amazing creatures. <laughs> Thanks, Don. Bye-bye, Dot.
look at where we are. <laughs> We're inside the Galapagos tortoise habitat. <laughs> Whoa, and look at him. Yeah, this is a Galapagos tortoise. Hello. <laughs> Whoa, yeah, this tortoise, his name is Aldo. He's a really nice tortoise. He's so slow. Whoa. <laughs> and so old. <laughs> yeah, he's so old. Galapagos tortoises can live into their late hundreds. And Aldo, yeah, he's 95 years old. Whoa. <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> Look at what I have. Some lettuce and some tasty kale. <laughs> Better save it for Aldo. Hello. <laughs> you want a snack? Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> Whoa. Whoa. <laughs> Look at his mouth. Oh, Aldo has really powerful jaws. Whoa. <laughs> his mouth loves munching green things. Yeah. Galapagos tortoises are vegetarian. <laughs> which means they like leafy greens and vegetables. Whoa. <laughs> but you don't want to get your fingers too close to their mouth. Mm -mm. Do you want another snack, Aldo? <laughs> Whoa. Here's another bite. Whoa. <laughs> He's so cute. Hey, did you know that tortoises and turtles are different? Yeah. This is a tortoise. Yeah, Aldo's a tortoise, which means he likes to walk around on the land. But tortoises aren't turtles. Mm -mm. Turtles like to be in the water. And some turtles, like sea turtles, swim and live in the water <laughs> and only come out of the water in case they need to lay eggs. <laughs> but tortoises like Aldo, yeah, he only goes in the water if he needs to cool off or take a bath. <laughs> oh, let's give him a little more lettuce. Whoa, here's another bite. Whoa, <laughs> yeah, and do you see this shell? This shell is part of Aldo's body. Yeah, it's not a shell that Aldo can crawl out of and find a new one. <laughs> no, that'd be so silly. No, this shell is part of him, yeah rose on his back. And depending on what type of Galapagos tortoise you are, you might have a different looking shell. Yeah, sometimes they're a little more open on the top, so the tortoises can reach up to get really, really high food. <laughs> and sometimes it's a little lower because they eat food on the ground. <laughs> Whoa, hey, and do you know what Aldo really likes? <laughs> Shell rubs. <laughs> Whoa. And scratches. Whoa. <laughs> He's really happy now. <laughs> Whoa. Do you see how Aldo is standing up? Look. He's standing up straight and he's in a trance. Whoa. <laughs> so silly. Yeah. Just like that. In Galapagos tortoises, this is called the finch response. <laughs> yeah, and that's so. Finches, yeah, the birds, can come in here and clean the tortoise's skin. And by straightening up in this trance, it gives the birds a lot of space to fly in and give little leg rubs, clean their neck. <laughs> Ooh, <laughs> he's so cute. Well, Tortoises are amazing, but they're endangered. <laughs> that means that they need to be protected. Thankfully, the San Diego Zoo protects them <laughs> and gives them lovely homes like this. <laughs> wow, I had so much fun at the San Diego Zoo. <laughs> well, that's the end of this video. But if you wanna watch more of my videos, all you have to do is search for my name. Hey, will you spell my name with me? Okay. Here we go. B-L-I-P-P-I, -P -P -I. Flippy. Good job. Well, I'll see you real soon. Bye-bye. Come on, everyone. Let's
Let's make room.